That's what's Alright, so here in about 10 minutes, we're gonna start the car. Yeah. We're really close. <laughs> 10 minutes. Maybe 9. Don't lie to those people. Maybe 9. About 9 minutes. We're gonna start it. As you can see, it's That's ready scary. to run right now. No, but it will be starting soon. I don't know if it'll be today, but it will be starting soon. What are you doing? I'm trying to get this crush gasket out. Now start it. I got all new exhaust gaskets all the way around, so I don't have any uh, exhaust leaks. I won't lose any boots. You don't have your boots. <laughs> I don't have any. It's just some. What? I don't know what you just said. I don't know what you just said. I said. What are you about to do now? Uh. Hmm. It's about to start. I guess pick it up, put it in the car. Not now? Yeah. Okay. No, I gotta put the crossover tube on. God damn it. Now. You putting the turbo on now? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put the turbo on outside of the car. It'll be a lot easier. You got the plugs and cools on. Got these banjo bolts. Harmonic balancer's on. It's ready to start. Almost. Right now. Start it right now. Uh, give it 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Get out. <laughs> 10 days. Ooh, it's got oil all in there, too. Did you get all that out or no? Oh, I'm missing a gasket. You didn't get all the... Pull out of turbo? No, you didn't. No. It'll blow out. I ain't missing a gasket though. What gasket are you missing? It's so tiny. The gasket to the bottom of the turbo. It's a whole drain. Yeah. Yeah, after this, after you put the turbo on, it's going in the car, right? Yes. The engine. Gonna is going back home. And then we got a lot of stuff to hook up. And we're going to drain the intercooler of the oil that I know is in it. It may start up today. The battery's charged. I guess we'll see. Okay, everything is bolted together. The turbo is on. I think everything's up. I guess we'll find out if something starts leaking. It wasn't hooked up. Yeah. I just gotta find a place to. And now, oh, that's in the way. It's in the way of hooking that chain up. Yeah. I probably, I wouldn't do that. But it's your, it's your motor, so you can. I mean, you can hook that wherever you want. You can hook it on this pipe. But if it was mine, no, no. But we're about to lift it and put it into the car. So we'll see how that goes. I'm trying to find the best place to put the uh, chain at. It was where the turbo's hooked up to now. <laughs> Ooh, there's oil all over that. This thing is gonna smoke like crazy when the first time it starts up. Which could be soon. Could be if I would if I stop losing crap. Yeah. 
that's not likely so it'll start up in at least a week for sure a week <laughs> no <laughs> if it doesn't start tonight it's starting tomorrow yeah for sure this engine will start tomorrow if it doesn't start tonight. And that bolt is not long enough. All right, so we're going to figure this out. Ooh, this could be bad. Or it could be good. Oh, oh. Hey, you're up. Hmm, that's... That's a little hard doing this by myself, so... Yeah, you messed that up. Oh, the cow? Mm-hmm. You need to go towards you. It's going to come forward some more when you let it down. Yep, it's hitting. It's back in its home, almost. Ugh. Plugging stuff up? Sure, I don't set the motor down on anything. Look at all those plugs. This motor's too smart. Oh no, the AC. Get everything out of the way. Yep. And everything that needs to be plugged up, plugged up. Okay. You need to take it towards you. Now is it going to mess that up? What? The compressor? Yeah. No, it's on the motor. It's attached to the motor? No, it's swiveling on it. See? Let's do that stud. Oh, you already put it in there? Yeah. Okay. It's really close to home. It is. The only bad thing is the motor needs to be tilted back just a hair. Not yet, it can't be. With only slight damage to that. Hi. Oh. Well, it's a little bit difficult to do this by yourself. Where's my cooler? Okay. Now there's a, a stud that's on the back of the head. We're going to get some stuff hooked up and try to get this motor in place. All right. He is under there hooking the transmission to the, hooking the motor to the transmission. Well, and then it's not we, as easy as it seems. And then we have a thousand million wires to go, and then we gotta fill it up with coolant. We may start it tonight. I think we're gonna get there. Do what? I think we're gonna get there. He thinks we're gonna start it tonight. And he's the one hooking it up and putting everything together, so I'm gonna have to go with what he says. We will see.
Okay, got the torque converter bolts in. And now he's got to do all this fancy wiring. That ball of wires right there. And a bunch of plugging stuff up everywhere. And you got to put the motor mounts on. Did you do that yet? Uh, you don't know? <laughs> you don't know if you put the motor mounts in? No, I forgot. I believe that. I'm concentrating. Leave me alone. <laughs> concentrating on plugging things in. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to make sure we don't have problems as in me forgetting one of these. Because I probably will. Oh, I'm ready for that. Let's see what kind of weird alerts the screen says in there when you go to start it. There's plugs everywhere. Yeah, it's kind of bad. <laughs> All right, the motor is mounted in there now. Transmission's all hooked up. Got a few plugs plugged in. Got more to go, obviously. You gotta get that. Intake on tomorrow. Got to put the intake on, and then the uh, the rest of all the plugs sorted out. Yeah, get all the plugs sorted out and get everything filled up with oil and coolant. Put the belt on. Put the fan on. So tomorrow this car will start. Yes. Hopefully, hopefully. Well, we will attempt to start it. Tomorrow. We will attempt to start it tomorrow. And that will be another video. Yes. <laughs> but yeah, this is where we are now. The motor is in the car. Got a few things hooked up. We're really getting yeah. a move on, anyway. It's actually going pretty quick because that hasn't even hasn't even been down a month, I don't think. Yeah, I mean, so as soon as we ordered parts, it's only been down a week. That's it.